good evening students welcome back welcome to the abacus classes i am your abacus teacher ms ganima singh i hope students that you are fit and fine at your places now students our today's video topic is pick fits method plus 1 plus 2 plus 3 yes kids today we will do the sums related to pick fits formula addition see as you know that we are discussing the addition formulas of big friends in addition formulas we have the numbers from 1 to 9 see plus 9 plus 8 plus 7 these three formulas we have discussed in one video next plus 6 plus 5 and plus 4 this plus 6 plus 5 and plus 4 these three we have discussed in our previous video now today we will discuss plus 1 plus 2 and plus 3 formulas addition formulas of big friends group now students as you know that with these three our big friend addition topic ends now in my next video we will do the sums related to big friends subtraction formulas So students, let's start our topic with the first sum, and in our sums we will use these three formulas. Now students, let's start our today's topic. As you know that our today's video is based on the formulas plus one, plus two, and plus three. These three formulas. But as I told you that the old formulas can also be there in the sums, like small friends and other big friends. means the formulas which you have studied before they can also come again in the sums so kids these big friends addition formulas and these small friend formulas should be in your finger tips means you should learn them properly so that you can apply the formulas directly in the two now let's start our topic with the first sum Now students, this is your first sum. As you know, the first row will go in ones row and the second row will go in tens row. Now let's add. As you can see in front of you, the abacus tool is there. As you know, the outer part is called frame. The midline is called the value bar, or you can only say bar also. These are a beads, or you can say these beads are up, so they are called upper beads. these beads are down so they are called lower beads now in this mid dot you do your calculations means you start your calculation from this mid dot now this rod is called unit rod second rod is called tens rod and the third rod is called hundreds rod in these three rods only gets we do our calculations it's ones tens hundreds One rod, ten rod, and hundred rod. Now, kids, I think that it's no need to write the names of these rods because now many times you have done the sums related to these rods, and now I think so you have learned that this is one rod, or you can say unit rod. This is ten rod, and this is hundred rod. Now, students, let's start our calculations. Now, first of all, add this one in ten rod. One means one beat up. Now add this nine in one row. See nine, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's one and nine ninety. Kids, you have to do the calculation in big friends from left to right. Yes. First of all, you will add the tens number. Then you will add the ones number. In big friends, you will do the calculations from left to. Left to right. Now next, this is completed. Now next, you will add five in tens row. Five. Now zero zero means nothing, so nothing. We will add. This is completed. Now next, add this two in tens row. Now you can see two beads are there. One, two in tens row. Easily we have added. Now next, add this. Three in 
one's own. Now you can see kids that four beads are already added. So how you will add three? Now there is lack of beads. Now whenever there is lack of beads, first of all you will go for the small friends and then you will apply the big friends. Now for adding three here in one slot, if we will use this small print plus five minus two. See students, if we will use this plus five minus two formula in this one slot, so you can see for adding three. The first number you have to add is 5. But you can see that 5 is already added. 5 pehle se hi added. 5 is already added. So how you will add this 5 again? This means you can't apply this small print here. So for adding this 3, you will use this big print. Plus 3 is equals to plus 10. Now this big friend you will use here. Now in my previous videos also I have told you that whenever you will add this 10, you will add this 10 in one rod up. Means that any time whenever you will add this 10, you will add this 10 in the second rod. Means if you have to add this 3 in one rod, this rod. So you will add this 10 in 10 rod. Plus 10, I have done here. Now minus 7 from the same rod. 5, 6, 7. Plus 10 in this rod, minus 7 from one slot. And now 3 is added. Nothing you have to do now. Plus 10, I have done in 10 rod, one rod up. And minus 7 I have done from the same rod. And 3 is added. Now next, minus 4. See, just take care of the sign kids. It's minus 4. Minus 4. 1, 2, 3, 4 beads are there. Now, minus 1. And plus 1 is completed. Now, count. See, 5 in 10 is not. And 1 in 1 is not. So, your answer is 51. I hope you got the sum kids. It's the same like the others only. The difference is we have used the plus 3 addition formula today. And in our old videos we are using the upper formulas. Now we will move to our next subjects. Now kids it's your second sum. Now as you know this first row will go in 1 slot and second row will go in 10 slot. Now let's start adding. Now first of all, set your abacus, upper beads up, lower beads down. Now first of all add 6 in 10th row. Now for 6 you know this 5 and 1 from down, 6. Next add the 6 in 1th row, it's 5 and 6. 66 we have added and this is done. Now next add this 1, 1 in 10th and 1's. So 1 in 10th. And one in ones, and this is done. Now next, add this three in tens one in this lot. Now you can see kids that only two beads are there. So you have to add three. Now for adding three, first of all add ten. See for adding three, five is already added. So we can't use this small print formula. So for adding three, we will go for the Big print formulas, which is our today's topic also. Now, for adding this 10, you will add this 10 in one rod up. Now, see, kids, this 3 you have to add in 10 rod here. So, 10 you will add here. In one rod up means in 100 rod. For this 3, 10 you have added in 100 rod, and then minus 7 from the same rod means 10. 5, 6, 7. And this 3 is added. Now next, you have to add this 3 in 1 slot. But you can see that only 2 beads are there. Now for adding this 3, again use this big print formula. Now 3 you have to add in 1 slot means here. So 10 you will add here in 10 slot. And minus 7 from the same. 
same rod means one zero. Five, six, seven, and both the threes are added. Now next add this two in tens rod. One, two, and then five in ones rod, and your sum is completed. So what is the answer, kids? I quote kids that you are getting the sums. You only have to apply this plus three formula in your sums wherever you get lag of B. So we will move to our next sum now. Now kids, it's your third sum. As you know, the first rod will go in ones and second will go in tens. Now set your abacus. Upper beads up, lower beads down. Now first of all, put the seven in tens rod. See five. Seven we have added. Now next six in ones. Five, six, and this is ten. Now next minus. See first of all minus five from ten star. Minus five, five we up, and minus five ten. Now zero means nothing. Nothing means nothing. We will add there. Now next we have to add this five in ten star. Now you can see that the bead is here. We can add five to the bead, so five we have added. Now next, add this three in one slot. One, two, three. Done. Now next, you have to add this one in ten slot. One bead up, and this is done. Now next, add this two in one slot. Now you can see here that four we have already added. So how we will add two? Now for adding two, first of all see the small print formula. Now for adding two, see the first number which you have to add is five. But you can see that five is already added. So you can't use the small print formula here. So for this, we will go for the big print formula. This plus two is equal to plus ten minus eight. This is our today's topic also. Plus two is equal to plus ten minus eight. This big print formula we will use here for adding two. Now for adding two, the first number which you have to add is ten, and we will subtract the print. Now, kids, I have told you about big prints that one is the print of nine, two is the print of eight, three is the print of seven. Four is the print of six and five is the print of five. See, you can create your formulas by yourself also, kids. Like for adding two, the first number which you will add is ten because ten and big prints are the best prints. So for adding two, the first number which you will add is Ten and you will subtract the print. Now who is the print of two? See there, eight. So you will subtract eight. Like this also you can learn. Like for adding two, first of all add ten. Blindly add ten and then subtract the print. Who is the print of two? The print of two is eight. So subtract eight. This way you can create your formulas by your own. Like adding ten and subtracting the print. But for creating the formulas. You should learn these friends. These friends should be in your finger tips. Now we have to add two. Now first of all add ten. Now see two you have to add in one slot. So ten you will add here in ten slot. And minus eight from the same slot. Five, six, seven. And your sum is completed. Two we have added by applying plus ten minus eight. Now come see five, six, seven, eight, nine in tens rod and one in ones rod. So your answer is ninety one. I hope kids that you get this sum. Now we will move to our fourth sum. Now kids, this is your fourth sum. Kids, just stay tuned to the video. 
video till last because after this plus two sums we will do plus one sums. So just stay tuned with the video till last. So our first row will go in one slot and the second row will go in ten slot. Now secure abacus scales. Our weights up, lower knees down. The best way to learn abacus is just play my video and do the sums with me. As the more you practice, the better the results are. Now. Put three ten slot. One two three. Then nine one slot for nine take the help of five five six seven eight nine. It's thirty nine. And this we have completed. Now next add this five in ten slot. See five three is there. We can add directly. We have done. Now zero zero means nothing. So nothing we will add. Now next add this two. In ten slot. Now you can see that only one bead is there. So for this two, we will apply this different formula because we can't apply small print as five is already added. Now for two, first of all add ten. Now ten you will add in one rod. Up. So two you have to add in ten slot. This rod. So ten you will add here. One rod. Up. And minus it from the same rod. Five, six, seven, minus eight from the tens rod. And this two is added. Now next, add this two in ones rod. Now you can see in ones rod also four is already added. Now for this two also apply this different formula. Now first of all add ten. Now see two you have to add in ones rod means this rod. So ten you will add here. One dot up and minus eight from the same dot means one dot. Five, six, seven minus eight from the same dot and this is also done. Now add five and ten dot and five and one dot. See five and ten dot and five and one dot. Now this is your answer. Your sum is completed. We have added five five. In tens and ones. Now count. See, it's it's one in hundred slot. See, in this we have used the hundred slot also. Five six in ten slot and five six in one slot. So your answer is one hundred sixty six. See, it's a sum in which we have used this hundred slot also. Now, kids, I hope that you get these sums of plus two and plus three. Now we will move to our fifth sum. And that sum will be of plus one is equals to plus ten minus nine. Addition formula of big prints. Now, kids, this is your fifth sum. As you know, the first row will go in one slot and the second row will go in ten slot. Now, kids, just set your abacus. Upper beads up, lower beads down. Now. Let's start. First of all, add this three in ten slot. It's one, two, three. Then add this three in one slot. One, two, three. Thirty-three we have added in the system. Now next, add this one, one in ones and tens. So one in ten slot, and this is one in one slot, and this is also added. Now next, add this five. Five in ones and tens. See the numbers are same in ones and tens. So five and tens are and five in ones. Five in tens, five in ones, five in tens, five in ones, and the fifty by this added. Now see kids, you have to add this one in tens are. But you can see that four is already added. Now for adding this one, first of all go for small print. But you can see in the small print formula, the first number which you will add is five because small prints and five are the best prints, and big prints and ten are the best prints. So for small prints, the first number which you will add is five. Now for adding one. In ten, the five is already added. So how you will add five again? This means we can't apply this small print formula here. So we will go for our big print formula. Plus one is equals to 
प्लस टेन माइनस This different formula we will use here in this sum. So for adding one, see one you have to add in tens rod, this rod. So ten you will add in one rod, that means hundred is rod. And minus nine from the same rod means ten is rod. Five, six, seven, eight, minus nine are ten means I have to call the gates back to its place. Now this one is. Now next, add this one in ones rod. Now you can see ones rod four is already added. Now again use this big friend formula here. Now one you have to add in ones rod means this rod. So ten you will add here. One rod up means in tens rod. And minus sign from the same rod means ones. So five, six, seven, eight. Your sum is completed. This one also you have added. What you have done for this one? Plus ten minus nine plus ten minus nine plus ten in tens rod and minus nine in ones rod. Now count the one in hundreds rod, one in tens rod and zero in ones rod. So one hundred ten is your answer, kids. I hope kids that you get this sum. Now we will move to our last sum case. Now, kids, this is your last sum. As you know, your first row will go in ones and second row will go in tens rod. Now, set your radius upper beads up, lower beads down. Now, let's start. As you know, our first number, which is two, will go in. Tens rod, so one. Now nine in ones rod. See five, six, seven, eight, nine. And this is done. Now next, add this two in tens rod. Now two, two beads are there. One, two. So two we have added. Now zero, zero means nothing. Now next, see minus two. It is there. Just aware of the. Signs. Be aware of the signs. See minus two. We have to do in tens rod. Minus two means one, two. Two beads back to its place. Now minus five in ones rod. See minus five. Ones rod minus five means five back to its place. And this is done. Now kids, you have to add this five in tens rod. Now for adding this five in tens rod, see beat is there. So five we have added. Now next you have to add one in one slot. See one you have to add here, but four is already added. Now kids, as you see one, don't rush for the big friends. As I have told you, first of all you will go for the small friends. When you can't apply small friends, then go for the big friends. Now for adding one kids, see what is the formula? Plus five minus four. Now for adding one, what is the formula for small friends? Plus five minus four. Now see, can you apply it or not? See for adding one in ones rod, plus five minus four. See five is not added, so you can add five. This means we can apply this small friend formula here. So you will not apply big friend. See kids, just try to apply the big friend. See in the sums in which you can apply small friends, in that place you can't apply big friends. Yes, it's a trick. If you can apply small friends, you can't apply big friends. And if you can apply big friends, then you can't apply small friends there. Just see how. See if you will add this one with the help of this big friend. See plus ten, plus ten you will do here. See for minus nine, for doing minus nine in ones rod, see B is not there. Only four Bs are there. So how you will subtract nine? This means you can't apply this big friend in this one. That's why you can apply this small friend. As I told you, if you can apply this small friend, you can't apply this big friend. And if you can apply this big friend, you can't apply the 
small print means only one type of method you can apply in your sum either small print method or big print method not in sum means in a number now for adding one just apply it now one you have to add in one zero so do plus five minus two one two three four and your one is added now count see five six seven in ten zero and five in one zero and seventy five is your answer I hope students you get these today's sums. Students, please learn these prints as from this prints you can create your big print formulas, big print addition and subtraction formulas by your own. So students, with this video I have given you one practice PDF. In the practice PDF there are sums related to plus one, plus two, and plus three formulas, and other formulas can also come in those sums. So do that sums in your abacus notebook in a neat and clean manner and kids if you will face any problem in any sum or in any pdf so you can call me in my number which i have provided you in the message with this video kids our big friends addition topic ends now in my next video we will take big friends subtraction formulas yes we will start a new topic big friends subtraction formula so students make sure you watch every single video and stay tuned to the video to learn more activity thank you